so what's going on guys Matt here with Drug Tech Reviews and welcome back to yet another video and in this video I'm going to be installing the DuckTales spoiler for the Civic 10th generation I have behind here so this spoiler did take around 2 to 3 weeks to arrive from China and I of course I did unbox it already to check and make sure the contents aren't broken but overall the quality seems to be very good but however today we will be going through the install process on the 10th generation Civic so if you guys didn't know I have a 10th generation Civic I've been using this car since uh, 2018 and I supposed to do a review on this car but however I've actually pushed it to uh, probably a future video but uh, today I'm going to be installing this with you guys so I'm actually pretty excited because I do not have a ducktail spoiler I have a roof spoiler but not a ducktail spoiler but today I'm going to be installing this and I've been looking for this design for like a couple of months now and I finally got one and the cost is not too expensive as well it's around uh, 140 ringgit so I consider this pretty cheap and the finishing of the paintwork especially it's uh, very good so I was thinking of getting this wrapped in fact but uh, looking at the paintwork I don't think I need to get it wrapped but I'll probably do some uh, minor detailing on this spoiler maybe like a stripe or something like that so we'll see how it goes but uh, for now uh, let me reverse this car back in and we'll go through the installation together So before we begin the installation, what came in the package is the spoiler itself. So this is the ducktail spoiler in gloss black. And they also gave uh, 3M tape. I think it's 3M tape and also some adhesive promoter which is basically primer to make sure the spoiler actually sits and sticks properly to the body of the car. So of course I do have a wrap on my car so I hope this will actually work. But so far my experience with uh, sticking double sided tape on the wrap has been okay. Uh, I do have some uh, door guard stickers which are also 3M back and uh, they seem to stick perfectly and they've uh, survived like for more than a year already and I uh, never had any issues so I'm hoping this will do the same because I do not want to, my spoiler to like, go flying away while I'm driving alright so let's uh, go about getting the sticker applied on the spoiler and then we'll get it stuck onto the trunk of my car Alright guys, so now they have got all the 3M tape stuck to the back of the spoiler. Now it's time to actually install it on the trunk. So this is the part where I'm pretty nervous because I cannot make any mistake because otherwise the wrap will be damaged. But uh, first things first, let's actually wipe down the wrap because I haven't used this car in a while so it's pretty dusty. So first things first, you want to make sure that the surface that you're sticking the spoiler on is clean. So in order to make sure that it's clean, I'm actually using Maguire's interior detailer so I don't know I've been using this for years seems to do the job all right so let's uh, continue the install process and I'll see you guys when the install is done Alright guys, so finally the install is done, wasn't the easiest thing in the world, I was actually very very paranoid that I would make a mistake and like screw up the whole install, however it was uh, manageable, I almost screwed it up but I managed to save it in time. So if you notice what I did was I actually kept portion of uh, the protective layer on so that I can actually make amends, however if you remove the whole thing and stick that's it because the gum will totally seal off the spoiler so if I have a little bit more I got some room to play and when I'm adjusting the spoiler so that's a tip if you want to install and make sure your install process goes smoothly so here it is as you can see right here so looks pretty sweet uh, 
of course, black on black, you can't really see the difference. But if you move it to the side, let me grab the camera. You can see the spoiler right there. So honestly, pretty nice. Considering that it costs 140 ringgit around that to actually get a spoiler like this and the quality is good as well Very very solid. It's not like some cheap ass product from China It's actually a very very good and well designed spoiler The fitting is perfect spot on on both sides very easy to install In fact, it was easier to install than my roof spoiler which I have on top right here Much easier to install the roof spoiler didn't fit that well and in fact the roof spoiler cost more than this so I think uh, this is a pretty good purchase. So alright guys, this uh, actually concludes my install of the Tactile Spoiler from my 10th Gen Civic. If you really like it, do hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe to this channel for more content just like this one. And I'll see you guys in the next video.